Hello and welcome. This is a five day video series. It's a nutrition for your daily mind. You see, this video has been designed to help your day with a five minute before activities. You see, all you have to do is watch this video five minutes a day. Prayer actually in the morning because this is going to shape the way your 24 hours is going to be. You see, this video, a lot of them will be interrelational, but some could be standalone. But the idea is to actually help you understand who you are. See, the topic of, of this video is to share with you the law of attraction. What is the law of attraction? Let us first of all consider this statement. You see, the natural law of the universe are so precise that we don't have any difficulties building a spaceship to send people into the moon and we can time the landing with a precision of a fraction of a second. Who actually said that? Dr. Von Braun. He was actually called the father of space program. This was at the time of President Kennedy, when the president actually asked this scientist what's going to take for a man to build um, um, a spaceship. Because he understands some certain laws. And this law, actually, like the law of gravity, if you throw anything up, it's coming back down. And it is, it is as simple as that. It is as simple as that. But the law of attraction, you see, the great leaders from generation, even before to now, as disagreeing in virtually everything, but they are in unanimous agreement to this statement, that the law of attraction means you attract and become what you think about. We attract and become what we think about. Well, that is huge. That is power. It's even in the book of Proverbs, it said, as a man thinketh in his heart, so is he. See, as you and I think in our heart, so is he. See, you need to get hold of this book by James Allen, as a man thinketh. This is a 1902 classic. I tell you, it is indeed a classic. He actually says something. He said, as a man thinketh in his heart, and as that man continues to think, he will remain. He also says something very interesting, that the greatest discovery of my generation is that man can alter their lives by altering their attitude of mind, meaning the way you and I think. This is general, that is power. See, there are 7 billion people in the world right now. But there's one thing that I know, that we only have one universe. We only work with one power. And there's only one law that works everywhere in your world. And you see, all these three things actually resonate in some way. Where? It's in our mind. Yes, exactly. It is in our mind. You see, this is what I know about mind. That in our, our thinking is our mind in motion. You might not understand what I just said. Let me explain to you. You see, when the air is moving... When the air is in motion, it means wind. We call it wind, right? So the same thing is when our thoughts actually set out in motion. It's called the mind. Okay? Mind. The thought is the most powerful element in the whole world. Because it penetrates all medium spaces and time in a fraction of a second. Okay? You might not actually get what I just said. Okay, let me explain that to you. For a second, I want you to take a second right now. Think about five years ago, the best thing that happened to you. You see, your mind can literally travel five years in time backwards and actually get a picture of when you actually feel good, when you were very, very happy. See, now if I ask you again, think about five, ten years from now, think about the good, the great stuff that you expect to come into your life. What's going to happen? You see, you can literally see what's going to happen five years from now. Ladies and gentlemen, that is power. That is why then you can understand that what James Allen actually says is, is correct. You see, how can we control our thinking? You see, our feelings and our thoughts are both of them. They actually create our future. See, the way you feel will generate the thinking, and that generates your life. You see, there's also that actually says that I dream my painting and I paint my dream. Do you see that? Because he could have the picture in his mind. You see, there's bad feeling and there's good feeling. See, because those are the feelings that generate your thoughts. See, bad feeling, there's something like resentment, worry, fear, depression, guilt, anger. See, all these things will erupt some negative thinking. Some negative thinking. And these are the good feelings. Happiness, excitement, faith, joy, gratitude, love. Love. That's even the most powerful one, right? That's even the most powerful one. You see, you need to understand that see, when you celebrate the good feeling, when you celebrate the good feeling, then you will draw more things 
that will actually make you feel good. Yeah, that's correct. That will actually make you feel good. You see, what are your thoughts and feelings? What actually are your thoughts and feelings? You see, 60,000 thoughts daily. That's actually what the scientist says uh, that's going on in our mind. 60,000. Ladies and gentlemen, that's a lot. But if you want, this one you want to understand. That you can actually shape your thoughts by your feeling. That is what the last slide actually says. You see, when you have the feeling that I don't want to be late, I don't want to be late. See, that is a feeling of fear, worry. Guess what? Negative thoughts start. Then, at the end of the day, you're going to be late. Trust me, you are going to be late. See, I don't like my boss. That's some anger. That's hatred. That's even a bad feeling. See, that is nothing good because it's going to interrupt some negative thinking. Then, guess what's going to happen? Your boss is never going to like you. That's exactly what's going to happen. You see, it's going to be a great having that promotion. Now, that is a good feeling. That is excitement. That is some happiness. Matter of fact, some fight because you, you, you're expecting you to have that, that promotion because when you have it, you're thinking about the good stuff that's going to come along with it, right? Exactly. Now, that's a good feeling. You see, my spouse is the best. What about love? See, now, you want to actually understand how you feel because how you feel it's going to determine what you think. And your thinking acts on the law of attraction. And law of attraction never pause. It never pause. So you want to pay attention to how you feel. Is it the good or the bad? Is it the good or the bad? See, because how you feel, like I said, is going to generate those thoughts. And your thoughts is going to act on the law of attraction. And that's what's going to bring about into your life. So ladies and gentlemen, I'm so glad I just want to share this five minute video with you so that you can understand what the law of attraction because I come up I come about this law um, actually February 19, 2011, and everything just changed just like that. Just like that. Because I became what I start thinking about. I literally became what I start thinking about. And you can become what you think about. You can become what you think about. Ladies and gentlemen, it is a pleasing pleasure and also it is a privilege. My name is Ayola Coach AOG Ogunrekun. I'm so glad I'm sharing this video with you. And I want to actually say that you can get connected with me even through my website or my Facebook account. Because especially when you go to my website, there's so, 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 so many um, um, information for free that you can, you can actually get to empower yourself. And, and this information... Trust me, because that's what actually made me who I am now. It can actually make you who you want to become. Okay, so I'll see you on the top, and God bless.